Welcome everyone to Mr. Adobe where you get prime educative videos on Adobe Premiere, Adobe Photoshop and Adobe After Effects. Before getting into the video, please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Without further ado, Mr. Adobe will be guiding you through today's video. Hello everyone, welcome to another cool and easy to follow tutorial on Adobe After Effects. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create the animated waving flag animation. It's a simple one, so let's get started. First things first, create a new composition. Now I'm going to import my required footages in the project panel. For instance, I'm dragging my footage called waving cloth in the composition panel. Let's play the clip from the beginning. I'm using a free footage downloaded from the internet. Here I'm pre-composing my waving cloth layer and naming it displacement map. You can see the two options, leave all attributes and move all attributes. Make sure to click on move all attributes in the new composition. After that, drag the flag image to the composition panel. Its size looks smaller than the composition, so I'm going to fit it accordingly. Then go to effects and presets and search for displacement map. Drag and drop it over the flag layer. You can see the displacement map effect in the effects control panel. In the displacement map layer, choose displacement map. From both use for horizontal and use for vertical displacement, choose luminance. and set the max horizontal displacement and max vertical displacement to 10. Our flag seems to be waving, but it doesn't look right. So let's make it more realistic. Duplicate the displacement map and drag it over the flag layer. Select the above displacement layer and choose multiply from the mode option. Wow, it's already looking better. Now let's drag the fabric tile PSD file into the composition panel. It adds more flavor to the final composition. You can now see that the fabric has large holes in it, so I'm fixing it. I'm applying the motion tile effect for the fix. After that, drag the fabric tile layer below the flag layer and duplicate the flag layer and drag it below the fabric tile layer. Go to the matte option of fabric layer and choose Luma inverted matte. So you can see like so in our composition panel. As a final step, Let's adjust the opacity of the fabric layer to make our flag animation look even more realistic. Here we go. That's it for today. If you liked the video, please thumbs up and let me know if you thought it was helpful in the comment section down below. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe us for more interesting tutorials on Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Premiere and Adobe After Effects. Till then, stay original, stay creative and have a good time.